Hey guys, so I am back again with another video. If you, if I look familiar from another video, it's because I literally just filmed another one. I'm still wearing the exact same t-shirt that I had on because you know I get real dressed up over here on my channel. But anyway, that's not the point. The point is, as I was filming my other video and trying to get my look decent enough to put upon the internet for you guys, um, I noticed that my eye was really bothering me and the more I investigated, the more I discovered that I think I'm getting the beginning of a sty or something of that nature and it just got me thinking like, I really need to sanitize, clean not only my brushes but my makeup as well because I don't want this to stick around, the sty or whatever is happening and I wanted to heal up really quickly. So one thing that I'm going to do, aside from cleaning all my brushes, is actually clean my makeup in the sense of I'm going to disinfect it and sanitize it so the next time that I use it after this has healed, um, hopefully I don't have to worry about it coming back in the future. Um, so it's super simple to sanitize your makeup. It's not this big in-depth process. So the way that I go about sanitizing my makeup isn't anything crazy. I literally just use uh, I don't have the bottle here with me, but anyway, I just use the isopropyl, isopropyl, iso I don't know, anyway, it's rubbing alcohol, I should know that I'm a nurse, but anyway, it's just rubbing alcohol. Okay, so, um, I've heard a lot of misconceptions about using, or sanitizing makeup, and using anything wet on eyeshadows, and that's what I'm going to be showing you today, it's just my favorite eyeshadow palette right here I just kind of threw this little guy together can you see what uh, shades are my favorite literally neutral browns and burgundy it's like my favorite go to every day love it need it gotta have it but anyway um, I'm gonna use it on one of my favorite palettes just to show you that it doesn't hurt the product as long as you do it uh, properly and it's not that hard really so all I have done is just taken the big jug uh, rubbing alcohol that you can get at the grocery store. I think I paid like a dollar forty for mine and it's I mean it's massive how much you get. I'm not gonna go through that in like a year. Um and I just put it in a little like travel spray bottle. I unfortunately didn't have any empty spray bottles here that I could use, but if you do, great, rinse it out and use that. Not a big deal. Let's start sanitizing, okay? Okay. So all I'm going to do is just open my bad boy up here. Maybe the purple Z palette. Oh, whoa, baby. Purple, purple. I love purple. Okay, so anyway, all I'm going to do is literally just give it a spritz. Nothing crazy. Don't give it a full bath. Just give her a spritz. Voila. That's all I did. Just three little sprays enough to make sure that I got every single shadow in the palette. Whew, that is strong. Um, and literally just wait until it dries. Alcohol is really great, it evaporates very quickly, so there's almost no wait time um, before you're allowed to technically use it again, before the eyeshadow is nice and dry. Like I said, I'd at least give it, I don't know, 30 seconds or so. Um, and to show you that there is literally nothing wrong with the shadow after spritzing it, I will swatch one here for you. There's my orange here is burgundy right there it's actually deep dancing um but anyway yeah there's nothing wrong with the product and it has literally been cleansed and sanitized um if you do makeup on other people i suggest you go and do this every day whenever you use the palette between customers between clients what have you um, it's just a really good way to keep your makeup clean and sanitized and make sure that we're not passing along any bacteria infections you know what have you just make sure that everybody stays nice and clean and safe with safety being the number one thing um but yeah that's that's all there is to it guys i mean like i said it's nothing fancy nothing crazy hard to do does so <laughs> so now we have nice and clean makeup for next time's use okay so that is literally it for this video guys i know it's probably like what two minutes long um but yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and jump off here. Thank you so much for watching again. I really appreciate it. Subscribe to my channel if you aren't already to stay up to date with myself and all of these crazy fun videos that we do over here and comment like whatever, all that good stuff, okay? You can find me on other social media platforms. Just look me up. I will have all my information posted down below. Um, yeah, okay. I'm done. <laughs> so I will, thanks again 
for watching, guys, and I will see you in, in my next video. Bye. Oh god, I look like a hipster. Oh god. Like, hmm, hmm, yeah, I'm gonna get